congratulations on your 60th anniversary of ordination. How blessed I am to have known you for 25 of your 60 years in ministry. You will remember that we first met at St. Paul's Lutheran Church in Lionville, when I, where I was the associate and you were the interim senior pastor, and I can still remember going to lunch at the Lion's Paw in town. And I can remember how nervous I was and how supportive and you made me feel and how immediately at ease I was. Who could imagine that I would then become your pastor 20 years later? What a blessing it has been to know you and your late wife, Joanne. You have been a supportive parishioner, a trusted and wise colleague, and a valued friend. What a blessing you have been to the people of Good Shepherd Lutheran Church for decades. And so today we all celebrate with you and give thanks for all of your years of ministry and all the ways that you have blessed the church for 60 years. We look forward to hearing your words of wisdom at the Synod Assembly in 2021. Hello, Dad. Hey, Grandpa. Hi, Papa. Congrats. Hey, John. We're here to say congratulations on 60 years of ministry. Wow. Congratulations. Is... Yeah, congratulations, Grandpa. This is a day the Lord has made, and we are rejoicing. Hi Dad. Hi, Dad. Congratulations on 60 years. That's really amazing. Uh, I got to be around for most of it, and I've gotten to live with you as a minister, and it's really nice just being able to see your values and your morals as part of my education and part of our life. I enjoyed very much that you got to uh, service at our wedding for Claire and me, and you got to baptize all three of my kids. Um, your ordination is a great achievement, and when you think in a 500-year religion, that you've been there for 60 years of it, spreading the ministry across this country. It's really an amazing achievement. I'm very proud of you, Dad. Congratulations. Congratulations, Dad, on 60 years of service to the ministry. You've done so much to help so many people, and you really should be proud. It's really, really awesome. Congratulations on 60 years, Grandpa. We love you. We really do. It's a big achievement, and we're happy you've made it this far, and hopefully many more years to come. Congratulations, Grandpa. So proud of you and happy for you. 60 years. Congratulations, Grandpa. On being a pastor for 60 years. Good morning, John. Congratulations on your 60 years of ordination. Wow, not very many people can say that. I also wanted to take this time this morning to not only to congratulate you, but to thank you for your ministry. And thank you for your support. You know, you've always had my back, especially when I was at Good Shepherd, and I really appreciate that. And I thank God for your ministry because you've served so many people over this, over all of these years. And I wish you many more years of um, ministry if you choose to do so, or maybe even just to take some time off for you and for your family. So congratulations, John. Congratulations on celebrating 60 years of ordained ministry. This is a huge deal and a big celebration. I wish I could be there to celebrate with you and to tell you how much you mean to me. You have been such a role model and such an important presence in my life, uh, from helping me through confirmation to taking me to my first synod assembly, to being the first person that I told I was gonna go to seminary to. You are an incredibly important person to me. I am so grateful for all that you have done and for all that you will continue to do. Congratulations on 60 years and may there be many, many more. Greetings, Pastor Carr. Congratulations on this, the 60th anniversary of your ordination. Our church is stronger today because we stand on the shoulders of dedicated servants of the gospel like yourself. And so from a thankful colleague, a grateful mentee, congratulations. I have so appreciated your mentorship, your wisdom, 
and your insight about being church in these times. So to find yourself continuing to be relevant after 60 years of ministry gives me something to aspire to and to look forward to. Thank you and congratulations. Pastor Kerr, congratulations and blessings as we celebrate with you your 60th anniversary of ordination into the ministry of word and sacrament. Thank you for sharing your gifts of wisdom and insight and experience with the Lord's church these many, many years. It is a joy and privilege to be your colleague. John, well done, good and faithful servant. Hey, Pastor John, I hope that you're well. I want to wish you congratulations on the 60th anniversary of your ordination. Um, this year, as I've been able to meet and get to know you through my time with Good Shepherd, um, it's been great to hear about your career in ministry, to learn about uh, the very beginning of your start as a pastor and moving out here and all of the good work that God has had you do to serve the church and to share the gospel with people. So best wishes for all of the celebrating that you get to be doing. Um, know that you are really loved by your Good Shepherd family. Happy 60th anniversary, Pastor Carr. I just wanted to say how much I have been blessed by you and appreciate you as a biblical scholar, producing light on the lessons and other biblical resources that have been wonderfully helpful. As a great interim pastor, and I was blessed to follow you a couple calls later and to have the chance to hear so many stories and so many positive impacts of your interim ministry. As a um, wonderfully highly anticipated supply pastor, the congregation looked forward to you being there and your worship leadership. And I look forward to the reports that you would write afterward about the response to your come to the gospel, true gospel preaching, and how 90% of the congregation was gone, but the remaining 10% was going to be very devoted, um, and things like that, that uh, made my day. I, I looked forward to coming back from vacation so I could read those. But I will always remember in 2010, that's the picture here, in 2010, when you celebrated the 50th anniversary of ordination, and you bounded up those steps, and then um, your speaking was wonderful, and it highlighted the impact of youth ministry and young adult ministry on you and the valuing of youth. And I thought that was awesome, that a pastor at the 50th anniversary was going to hold up youth ministry and encourage that. It's typical of you. So you have been a blessing to so many. I am grateful. Happy 60th ordination anniversary. Hi, John. Congratulations on the 60th anniversary of your ordination. The church has been blessed by your many years of ministry, and we have been blessed by your presence in our group and your friendship. God bless you. Hey, Pastor Carr. Congratulations on 60 years of ordained ministry. God has blessed you, and God has blessed us through you. Thanks for all that you've done and all you continue to do. Congratulations, Pastor Carr, on the 60th anniversary of your ordination. Hello, Pastor Carr, and congratulations on your 60th anniversary of your ordination. Certainly something to be very proud of. We'd just like to take a minute to thank you for your service of Good Shepherd. Over the years, we've been so lucky and blessed to have you in our congregation. Always enjoyed your sermon, especially the way you always put some humor in them. And of course, uh, when I was on council years ago, your guidance and help uh, were between pastors. So again, congratulations on this milestone anniversary, and thanks again so much for your service at Good Shepherd. Thank and you. Happy 60 years of ministry to you. Happy 60 years of ministry to you. Happy, Happy 60 years of ministry, Pastor Carr. Happy, Happy 60 years of ministry to you. Hi, Pastor Carr. 
Happy 60 years of ministry. Congratulations. Thank you so much for all the love and guidance you've given our family over the years, and especially to Courtney. Again, congratulations. Hi, John. It's Don and Marilyn Anton. We just want to wish you a happy 60th anniversary from your ordination. What a remarkable job that you've done. We really enjoy when you preach and you give us the little tidbits of what's going on in the Bible before the story that you're preaching about. Thanks again. Have a wonderful day. Congratulations, Pastor Carr, on the 60th anniversary of your ordination. Congratulations on the 60th anniversary of your ordination, Pastor Carr. It's a remarkable achievement for a remarkable preacher. I always enjoy listening to your sermons. Have a great time celebrating. Hey, Pastor Carr, congratulations on 60 years of your ordination. That's awesome. Yes. Congratulations, Pastor Carr. Glad I got to meet you in 60 years. Fantastic. Hi, Pastor Carr. Congratulations on the 60th anniversary of your ordination. Um, you have been a blessing to Good Shepherd and to me and my family. Um, you and Mrs. Carr have been um, one of the stones of the foundation of my own faith growing up. And I don't think that I'll ever have a holy week where I don't yearn to hear Mrs. Carr singing um, on Monday, Thursday, and Good Friday. Um, and you have no reason to know this, but we often sat behind you um, in church. And I always watched you because you were such a active and intentional listener before I really knew what that was, but it always just fascinated me. And I always thought that when I grew up, I'd finally be like that. Yeah, I'm still working on it, but, um, I always noticed that my favorite thing is when you're um, doing the service and you do the words of institution, you you don't just say the words, you act them, and it's beautiful. And I think that that kind of speaks to your ministry because you aren't just words, your actions too, and all to glorify God and, and to share his love with us. Um, I, you've been with my family through some of our happiest and hardest times and your, um, guidance and prayer and comfort will never, ever be forgotten. Um, so congratulations on 60 years of faithful service and just know that the Santini family loves you. Pastor Carr, congratulations on the 60th anniversary of your ordination. We feel privileged to have you as a member of the Good Shepherd family. You have enriched us all with your active participation here on the Hill. Best, Best wishes, wishes to, to you, you and, and your, your family. family. Pastor Carr, it's me Kay. I just wanted to congratulate you on your 60th anniversary of your ordination. What an accomplishment. I wanted to let you know that I'm so happy that I've gotten to know you over the past few years. You are quite a human being, and I feel very blessed to have you in my life. Can't wait to see you again. Um, so take care, take it easy, and again, congratulations. Congratulations, Pastor Carr as you celebrate 60 years of ministry. Thank you for sharing your knowledge and wisdom as a preacher. During Sunday school classes and Bible studies. Book clubs, movie nights, and pub theology. We enjoy your insight and cherish your friendship. We are blessed to have you as part of the Good Shepherd family. Hey, Pastor Carr. Congratulations on 60 years of ministry. I'd like to thank you for all you've done for many people. I know you've touched my life and you've touched Stephen. I'd like to wish you many more years of great work for 
God and again say congratulations to you on 60 years of ministry. Thanks. Have a great day. Hello, Pastor Carr. Just wanted to take time out to wish you the best on your 60th anniversary of ordination. Can we really be that old? Stay healthy. Thinking of you. God bless. Happy 60th ordination, Pastor John. <laughs> we miss seeing you at church. But want you to know that we miss you and love you and really appreciate all the Bible stories and Bible lessons that you tell us. So, take care. Bye-bye. Hi, John. I wanted to take this opportunity to wish you a happy anniversary of your installation. And um, just to tell you how much I've appreciated our friendship for so many years. Um, I've always enjoyed when we've been in Sunday school class together, um, when you've led us in worship, and uh, of course the many just uh, casual conversations that we've had. Um, but I especially want to thank you for the times that we work together uh, in Pastor Julie's absence to serve members of the congregation um, who were dealing with uh, difficult situations and crises. Um, you've always been there for me to talk things through um, to offer your good counsel and um, and just to help us do as much as we could to help people uh, during their time of need. Um, so I really appreciate that and I feel blessed um, having known you and worked with you and, and can uh, look forward to uh, many other times of being together and sharing times together. Okay, John, I wish you the best, and again, happy anniversary. God bless. Hi, John. When God called you to be a pastor, God blessed so many people. May you, in turn, be blessed to feel God's love and the love of everyone who surrounds you, both today and always. Amen. Hi, Pastor Carr. It's Kira and Kirsten Zadraco. We just want to wish you, uh, or congratulate you really, on your 60 years of ordination. It's wonderful milestone. We love you. You mean a lot to us. And I hope you have a really, really good year and many, many more years to come. Right, Kira? Yep. Congrats. Happy 60th anniversary, John Carr. Today, I stand with all of the saints to say thank you. Thank you for being who God created you to be. Some would say you're like Abraham because of your faithfulness. Some would say you're like Moses because of your leadership. Some would say you're like Solomon because of your wisdom. Others would go New Testament and say, no, he's more like, like Peter or Paul because of his preaching and teaching. Others might say, no, for me, he's more like John because he has been a great friend. For me, you have been Barnabas, an encourager, someone who has been willing to walk with people along the way, pointing, encouraging, giving words of good counsel. I also think that God would say all of the above, you have been a good and faithful servant everywhere that you have served. And today we say thank you from a grateful synod and a grateful church for your witness as a pastor that has served all people well. Thank you so much for all that you have given. Know that we are ever grateful for your light in the midst of darkness 
your words of hope and encouragement in the midst of despair and your words of joy and laughter on the journey. God bless you even more in the years to come.